Hey guys, welcome back to the underground. Uh, today, a game has dropped on the. Oops, sorry. A game has dropped on the UK store and ES store called Coaster by Binary Media. So it contains four different tracks. It's going for about seven pounds, just above seven pounds. And uh, so, just wanted to show off some first impressions, tell you guys how it feels, what it looks like. Um, so, without further ado. Uh, let's check it out. Um, it does say you can use the move controllers, but there is no like shooting or anything um, There's uh, there's a boost though, so we'll see what the boost and the break is all about um, We'll start we'll just go I guess um, Let's start with the room. I want to save the space ones for last because those I'm actually kind of excited for um, So let's check it out Everyone's having a great day so far. Great morning. All right. Okay. So while the graphics aren't like extremely realistic or anything, it's actually pretty clear. <laughs> World exclusive. World premiere. What's up, McCon artist? Um, so we're starting out in this room. Um, the graphics, they look pretty basic. Um, let's see how this feels, though. Uh, we're going through this room. Whee! <laughs> uh, I want to use this boost. There we go. Let's get this thing going a little faster. I like that there's a boost button. It's actually kind of nice. Um... What's up, Mahudin? Uh, feels uh, actually pretty smooth so far. Um, but like I said, you know, graphics aren't like really anything impressive. Kind of like PS2 looking in terms of textures and geometry. But the resolution is pretty clear, which is nice. I am playing on the Pro, of course. Your long shadows. How's it going? Get to the choppa. Wee. <laughs> Uh, it's like a small little, you see a chopper. Uh, I, I really like that there's a boost button. There's a good sense of speed um, with the boost anyways. I'm trying to go as fast as I can. It's kind of interesting going through this room. Uh, that was it though. Um, it is only like $7, so I'm not expecting anything mind-blowing here. Um, it was kind of fun, really short though, as expected. Um, so next we're going to do Picnic, and then we're going to go, actually we'll do one Space one, then Picnic, we'll mix it up. Um, let's do Space Coaster, because I'm actually excited about this one. Um, let's see here. One small step for man, another step for VR. <laughs> it's a good question. Oh yeah, this is definitely a tiny bite size, probably most likely like a mobile port um, that came over. Um, surprised it's like, uh, surprised how like smooth the track feels actually. What's up, Daniel Siri? Um, yeah, like I said, I was expecting it to be like a blurry, jaggy mess and like the graphics aren't great, but but it's not blurry at least, which is nice. Um, and the, the coaster itself feels pretty smooth. Um, it's, it's not the worst that I've played. I've played some awful roller coaster games. Um, we were just talking about how we want some more roller coaster ones. Oh, snap, what's going on here? Interesting. Kind of just like a flat background. Yeah, the scale seems okay. <laughs> definitely, definitely not anything that's going to blow anybody away. 
Yeah. I love being, uh, I love being in space in VR. What's up, Hizzy? Um, the track, yeah, like I said, the, the, the things that kind of matter, the, the very basics, it's, it's kind of alright. <laughs> um, definitely more firewall on the way. Yeah, these are, like, really short. I mean, what was that, like a minute long? So, I mean... Um, I don't know. It's it's a little undercooked. <laughs> Thank you, your large size. Um, no, it's I mean it's it's competent in what it does. It's just it's it's not gonna blow you away, but it's kind of just you sit and. Uh, and you just go for a minute, and um, I like, like I said, I like that there's a br uh, a boost. I haven't even used the brake. Uh, obviously, um, these are interesting. Uh, I don't even feel like I'm moving. It's <laughs> it's not the Dark Souls of roller coaster games that I can confirm. Um, we oh, we're going into the pie. Um. Yeah, like, it's, it's alright. I mean, it's a seven-pound game. Hey, buddy! Uh, the scale of the stuff is okay. Well, I think there's just a lot of mobile titles that get ported over. And, you know, I don't mind, like, small indie games and stuff. Um, as long as we're getting, like, bigger games in between. But, yeah, we're not getting, like, a whole lot of triple-A games. <laughs> Goes to shit with shape, doesn't it? Whee! Yeah, there's not like... <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot to mention there was pie in this. Um, I like the idea of the tracks and stuff. There's no, like, loops, though. Like, these these dips right here, like, whee! These are decent, but there's no, like, like I want to be doing flips and stuff. Um... There's no, uh, no flips. At least there's some, like, stuff going on around here. There's some whipped cream, some donuts, wine glass, cheese. Always good with cheese. The backgrounds don't look very good here. The background, besides this grass that's up close, the background just looks like a flat image. <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> Yeah, I would love like a little bit more intensity. Yeah, it definitely looks like a wallpaper. Uh, this one's going up. Yeah, this is very much like a. Uh, I don't know. I when I I like to put people into Rush of Blood. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't think there's a platinum. Let's see. I, I don't think there's. Oh, there is. Complete all coasters three times. There's there's a there's trophies. The levels are very short. It's four levels and they're about a minute each, and the trophies are like doing them three times, um, and that's it. So this is the last one. This is Moon Coaster. Um. Let's see here. Yeah, it's uh. You know, it's, I would have liked, like, some more, like, flips, and, like, Shadows was saying, some, like, turn, sharper turns and stuff. Yeah, this, I think this wouldn't be a bad one to, like, throw somebody into VR, but, but again, like, visually, it's not that impressive. Like, it, like, it's solid. Like, the graphics are solid and stuff, but it's not, like, anything impressive. Oh, it's three times more expensive than the PC version. What's up, Paul? Yeah, it seems like it would be a better, like, two, three dollar game. No, for real. This, you could make something ten times better in Dreams. Um, I mean, it's, it's competent. It's just not anything that great. Like, 
I mean, I am a little initiated for <laughs> PR roller coasters, but. Three ninety nine on PC. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, dreams with VR. People are gonna make some crazy stuff. What's up, Mad Man? Um, I can't boost anymore. <laughs> oh yeah, lock and key. I have no idea what this is made on, um, but. It looks like. Yeah. Yeah, it's not like Ocean Descent or VR Worlds, PlayStation VR Worlds, where it's just like short, but it's like wow. Um, this uh, I don't know. It's it's okay. It's it's nothing. It's nothing special, but it's not bad either, though. Um, it's just nothing that great. Um, obviously really short, under $10. Um, am I in the air? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the comics for sure. Um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's all right. I, I can't like super recommend this but it's not the worst thing ever it's at least really smooth um, it seems like it's it's got a nice frame rate no no I agree man man aside from Russia blood they haven't done anything like on point yeah Yeah, it kind of, I agree, uh, Raven, it, it kind of just exists. This was actually maybe my favorite one, was this room, because there's just like, it's just kind of cool to be like shrunk down and and go around this room. Um, I like this one the most. But it's, it's really short. I mean, you're going to, unless you want to repeat them over and over, I mean, you kind of just go through them, but. This was definitely my my favorite one so far because it kind of like goes around. Not super overpriced, but should still be a little bit cheaper. No, for sure, Kevgret. Yeah. Oh, did did Roller Coaster Legends have crazy frame rate issues? I don't remember that. Um, but yeah, I mean it's it's kind of chill. It's it's okay. Like I said, it, Raven nailed it. It kind of just exists. <laughs> like it's not like it works. It's smooth. It feels smooth. There's a decent sense of speed. Hey, doggy. Um, the scale is okay. Like I feel like I'm tiny and I'm in this like giant room shrunk down in like some like somebody's apartment or something or whatever um, but for as simple as it is I wish it looked a little bit better <laughs> yeah this is not this is not a uh, gonna blow you away in 2020 um. <laughs> Paul, when is Gordon releasing? Uh, yeah, your long shot is I have been playing Dreams a little bit on the side. Um, and it's incredible. Yeah, it's, it's pretty incredible. Once it gets VR, I mean, the stuff people are going to make is going to be... This, this seems like something you could make in dreams, like, for real. Like, you could probably make something a lot better in dreams, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, I mean, this is just as basic as it gets. Meow, game cat. Um, this is just, like, as basic as it gets. Uh, nothing special. 
the, like I said, you know, if it if the graphics were a little bit better, um, it'd be a little bit cooler. I like the little the little cart though that they have us in, a little space cart. Um, but yeah, man, hopefully uh, you guys got a good look at that. Hopefully did a good job giving you some impressions. Um, so yeah, I will uh, thank you guys so much for joining. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll uh, catch you guys later. <laughs> See you guys.